think the youth can get involved in migration clubs to educate themselves and the peers and their peers about the dangers of irregular migration. One way we can stop irregular migration is by creating equal opportunities. Today, I want to tell you about the benefits of migration. First and foremost, remittances. Remittances are the benefits people in Ghana receive from their relatives abroad. My young people migrate for various reasons. Uh, this may be due to uh, important life transition decisions, such as uh, getting married, uh, uh, having higher education, and also to, uh, also to uh, seek medical care. What can you do about irregular migration? In my thinking, I believe strongly that the first thing young people have to do is to hold their government accountable and make sure that the leaders provide the enabling environment for them to remain in the country. The first benefit is that it promotes education and training. And by education and training, we mean that individuals from Ghana go to other countries, acquire knowledge and come to the country to apply. Example are individuals that go to Cuba to study medicine and come back here to impact people's lives. First and foremost, we have to change our mentality. We have to come to believe that there is no place like home. And indeed, we can work hard to make our home countries look like whatever country we dream of.